Our world is beautiful and diverse. There are many different cultures, each with their own histories, customs, traditions, values, arts, and food. Sometimes disagreements arise when groups don't understand each other or when one group wants to have power over another group. But there are also many examples that demonstrate how people of diverse cultures and heritages can be friends and stand up for one another. For example, you may have learned about Frederick Douglass. He was a former enslaved person who was known for his persuasive speeches and writing. While working to abolish slavery, Frederick Douglass gave several speeches standing up for the Chinese community. Grace Lee Boggs was a Chinese-American civil rights activist whose life and work exemplify cross-racial solidarity. While she was of Asian-American heritage, many of her actions were focused on improving the living conditions for black communities. She and her husband James helped co-found Detroit Summer, an organization intended to connect and empower local youth to improve their communities. Larry Etliang was a Filipino immigrant who personally witnessed the poor treatment of workers in these industries. Together with Dolores Huerta and Cesar Chavez, they brought together Filipino and Mexican farm workers. The three leaders recognized that they could be more successful by working together instead of independently. Starting in 1968 at San Francisco State University, the Asian American Political Alliance, Black Student Union, Mexican American Student Confederation, and the Native American Student Alliance joined forces. They worked together to improve the admissions process to call for more teachers from diverse backgrounds and to create ethnic studies programs. These are just a few examples that demonstrate what is possible when people of different communities come together. Can you think of any other examples? Think about your own circle of friends. How might you widen your circle to include even more people who might have different backgrounds from you?